Hello all, this is Tarun. Here I am going to show you a common bug in all versions of Nuke. Even I cannot say that this is a common bug in all versions uh, because whenever we are creating any custom user tabs in project settings, it should be deleted uh, when we are closing our comp, right? But I am not sure that this is a uh, bug in Nuke because maybe Nuke has been designed in such a way that uh, the tabs shouldn't be deleted in project settings. But we know that the custom tabs in project settings is not deleting by default whenever we are closing our comp right but the reason why i am saying this as a bug is i have seen in boundary support portal i'm going to my chrome new support portal click on boundary support and check this bug tracker and switch off this knowledge base and in here click on new family um, I'm searching the keyword as create user norms in root table. See, these are the two tabs which have already raised. I'm going to open that in new tab. Okay, for this issue, um, we have already seen in the previous video. See, custom user norms created in at root level duplicate when script is closed and reopened we have already seen this in the previous video and also they have mentioned that to fix this uh, solution they was targeting in the uh, release of 12.2 version 6 yes they have fixed in 12.2 version 6 but the issue is still remains in 13.0 version 1 so far only that i have made a previous video regarding how to delete custom user knobs in project settings by default okay uh, we have seen already regarding this in the previous video so i'm going to the next issue see here they have mentioned that user knobs on the root node should be removed by nuke.script clear right uh, and also they have mentioned that um, they are getting this issue in these versions of nuke but actually not only in uh, these versions of nuke they are getting in all versions of nuke okay uh, let me show you that I'm going to my explorer. See, uh, I have tested in all possible versions. Even I have tested from Nuke 9 to the current latest version of Nuke 14. This is this is actually beta version. Even I have tested in this uh, beta version. First of all, let me show you in uh, Nuke 14.0 uh, version 1. Then quickly I will show you the other versions of Nuke. Okay, I'm opening Nuke 14.0 version 1. See, I have downloaded uh, three videos from internet. I'm going to save these uh, each file in a each work file. First, I'm going to um, import this one. Before I'm going to save this work file, what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to store this read notes metadata in project settings. So for that, I have made a simple script. So Python. So I'm going to open my script editor. This is the script. Sorry, this is the whole one. This is my script. So I'm selecting this node and I'm running the script by control N. I'm dragging my properties to here. So when you see the project settings, see uh, this is the name of the read node. So I'm naming that tab as Andres in Forest. So the tab name will be the file name. And I have stored the file name over here. So the frame range is uh, 1 to 820 and the total range is uh, 820, 820 frames. So I'm going to save this to my desktop, home, desktop, rainy, zero one. Okay, now I have saved this, right? So I'm going to close this. See, when you check the project settings, even if you have closed this project, the tabs are uh, remain same here, right? So now I'm going to import the second video. Which is the drone. So I am getting back to my history of my script editor. I am starting this and I am running this again. See, when I run this, what it's doing is it's created a tab with the file name of drone, right? But the norms are storing in this tab, right? Uh, but basically, uh, Nuke works uh, in this way. So if you want these tabs to be in drone one, go to user norms. So you have to pull up your uh, drone one. See, now you got all the knobs here, right? This tab is empty. Now we got the all the, all the knobs here. Okay, as of now, I am saving this to my desktop as 
from now i'm closing this now i'm going to now i'm going to the project settings but still we know that the tabs will remains here so now i'm going to import my third video i'm i'm getting back my script and control enter so in project settings you can see that the new tab has been created uh, with the file name for the napsa story here right this is happening in the latest current version of new 14 right so i am going to save this into my desktop as like so let me show you in quick with the other versions of nuke so i am closing this i am going to nuke 13.2 version 5 i am I'm opening this So I'm going to my downloads. I'm importing this file. I'm going to my script editor. I'm selecting this node and I'm playing the script. See when you see the product settings, the tab has been created here. So I'm closing this and I'm importing the second video. And we run this now. See now the new tab has been added. Closing this and again and, I, and again I am importing this lake and I am running the code. See now it's adding one more tab. Right? So I'm closing this 13.2 version 5 and I am going to new 11th latest version. I'm going to import my footage. I'm going to script editor. I'm, going to, I'm editing the previous scripts and I am pasting the new one and I am pasting the node and I'm running this. You see in product settings the tab has been created and I'm closing this. I'm importing the second video. I'm selecting this node and I am running the script again. In project settings, one more tab has been added. I'm closing again. I'm adding the third video and I'm running the script again. See, now the third tab has been added. So, like this, I have tested with um, all these versions of Nuke. So, how can we fix this? You can find my code in the description of my previous video. YouTube. This is my previous video. See in the description I have added the GitHub link. Click on this. So go back to one step and click on this code. Download as a zip. So I'm closing this. So go to dot nuke. I don't have any custom script over here. I'm going to my downloads. See, this is the zipper which I have downloaded from GitHub. So go to this and in delete all nodes. I have to so select these two and drag into your dot new directory. I'm closing this. I'm closing all. So now, when you launch any versions of Nuke, you will not face that issue. So I'm now I'm going to. So let's open the version as um, twelve point two version eleven. Now, see, I'm going to my downloads and I'm going to my import my video footage. I'm dragging the top disk into here. I'm opening my script editor. I'm closing this. And I'm running the script. 
Now the tab has been created, right? So when I close this, and when we see project setting, see the tabs has been deleted. Now I'm going to import the second footage. My name is same script. See now that gets created. Now when I close the comp and the no, and when you see the process settings, see there is no tab. The tabs which I have created has been deleted. So you can use this Python script uh, to fix this issue. Okay, I hope you have learned something useful in this video. Thanks for watching.